so for us uh, the decision for ib and cbse one definitely was where we want to further educate the child and we said push comes to shove we are okay sending him overseas but we believe that in another 4 5 years which is we got him into ib last year it would open up so 6 years was good enough time to take that risk the second reason we uh, contemplated lesser than we would have is that the school always will give you a choice to move back to cbse so look what two years we put him here and we can always move him back the deciding factor to move him to ib was vihan is a very curious child you can't tame him to a you know a boundary and uh, first reason for choosing heritage is it gives him that uh, leeway and i would call it luxury so we said if that can continue and expand his horizons why not because vihan gets into depth of anything that he does he goes researches so it lends to vihan's personality so that was one reason which we considered moving him to ib the teacher to child ratio is very good the uh, uh, independence given by the teachers to the, uh, to the student is you know is great because they give them options uh, i really personally really like the fact that uh, if there is an assignment to be done they don't uh, dictate what method to use for example they may they may say depending on the child's interest if you want to write about it if you want to draw about it or if you want to click pictures and you know post about it i find that's very great because not every child likes to write not every child might like to draw but the fact that they are given that independence to choose how they want to express themselves so i think that really goes a long way in um, in making the child also independent uh, in choosing what they want to do i feel like the approach is really where ib shines i think in cbsc when i was in 8th grade we were always told to you know memorize this and it wasn't really about learning and in ib of course you have to memorize i mean i had biology and psychology and if i couldn't memorize things definitely wouldn't have been able to even pass those but i feel like ib really emphasizes understanding concepts and you know trying things out for yourself and i think that is sort of limited in cbsc so our daughter was uh, in regular cbsc and we are very happy with the performance yeah, but last year in grade 6 she moved to ib and if i look back this last one year uh, i i would say i would extremely thrilled with the way she has evolved in last one year and one of the big difference that i have seen in last one year is her ability and persistence to question and reason for example uh, we got a society form and we are filling uh, for a club membership and it said against each name male or female and so my daughter was standing next to me and she said why only male and female and i asked why not she said but there are transgenders the binary people where are those choices and i was stuck for a moment i don't know what to respond but at the hand side i when i look back i think this is phenomenal because given the times we are living in reasoning and questions questioning is the fundamental of human kind and i'm so so proud that she has evolved into this slightly more matured person in the last one year and is questioning and reasoning out all all possible outcomes so extremely thrilled with her performance